I think it's a mess, actually. I think it's a bit of a mess. I, um, I'm not happy about Spain jumping up and down and grandstanding about Gibraltar. Gibraltar came by treaty, 1713, Treaty of Utrecht, so they don't have a chance to get... The people of Gibraltar want to be British, not Spanish. I think we need more information, especially for the public. I think it's all very well saying we've got a Brexit deal and we're going to be happy with it, but there's not enough information to back it up. A mess. Nobody, nobody seems to know. And we don't know where the truth is who is lying and who is saying the truth. I think Gibraltar will have to pay uh, 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 or suffer some consequences as a result of Brexit. No, I'm not very happy with what Mary, uh, Theresa May is doing at all. I don't really know. It's, uh, there's a lot of conjecture, a lot of misinformation, disinformation, so I don't really know. We'll just wait until, until everything pans out. I think it's getting tiresome, admittedly, but it is an important issue for Gibraltar and for, and for the UK. And I think it's the, the, the turmoil that it's causing is all based on the misunderstanding of what was, uh, going to, what was going to happen. I think it's terrible because basically it's going to affect Gibraltar quite a bit. Like I'm hoping that they will come out with the positive uh, deal for everyone. I think that uh, Britain has been made an example of uh, because obviously the EU don't want lots of other countries to leave. See, I voted for Brexit but because I'm now living in Gibraltar I've become a Remainer so um, I just hope Mrs May can sort it out but it's not the ideal solution that she's presenting to Parliament. It may fail in Parliament and then where are we? But we stay British. <laughs>